Hey guys, it's Lane and Blake from Redefine Horizons, and this is the second video that I'm doing in the little set of videos about how we manage our social media content in Trello. So in the first video, I walked you through the structure of this content marketing board, and then in this video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how we schedule content once it's, once it's ready to go. So I've got some content here that we need to get out this week. So we've got these five repeatable posts. We've got this one unique post here that's ready to go. And so what we're going to do is we're just going to click on each one of these that's ready. We're going to go to copy. And then we're going to go ahead and move it to our board that's for our uh, social media calendar, which I have to find. There it is. <laughs> Sorry, social media calendar. And uh, I'm going to just go ahead and dump everything on Monday for now, and then we'll we'll go ahead and move those. So we're just going to come in and do the same thing on all these, except I won't take as long now to I won't take as long now to get to the uh, to the board. So we're just creating copies of these. All right, guys, so what I've done now is I, I've moved these cards over to the calendar, okay, so they're ready to go. And so what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to – we want to remember that these have gotten scheduled. So we're going to go ahead and pull them over here, and uh, this list will go in reverse chronological order. So we'll always see the most recent stuff posted here at the top. And then we're going to go ahead and jump into that other board. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so here's our social media calendar. And you can see we've stacked everything on Monday. So we don't want, we don't want seven posts to go out Monday. So here's what we try and do. We try and post two to three times a day at the most. And we try and make sure that we're getting some... Uh, different type of content out every day so that we don't irritate people Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to just go ahead and spread this out a little bit So we're going to do something like this this one I got twice so let's go ahead and delete that it doesn't need to go out twice this week So what this tells you is I'm a little short on my content, right? I need some content for Thursday and Friday. We don't typically post on the weekend. However, I know I've got a couple of, of new marketing videos that we're going to uh, put out. I uh, actually have several. So we're, we're going to fill this up without a whole, a whole lot more effort. So now, now they're ready to go. These, are, these posts are ready to go. So let me show you how we actually do that on Buffer. That will be the second part of this video. So let's go ahead and... Open up Buffer. There's other tools like Buffer, like one's Hootsuite. There's different tools. Buffer's the one I like. All right, so you can see in here I've got three accounts linked. So I've got our, our company page at Facebook is linked. I've got my Twitter account linked. And then I, I've got my LinkedIn account linked. Now we also have a learning channel on YouTube. And we have a, a learning channel we have a, a learning channel for Facebook, learning page for Facebook for Redefine Horizons that are not connected. So some of this we do manually. Okay, but for now we're just going to do these three. Okay, so you can see uh, this is blank because I haven't done that shit this week. That's okay though. It's still, uh, it's still early Monday afternoon. Um, so we're going to go ahead and fill up tomorrow's hopper. Okay, so uh, what we do is we come back to Trello and we say, all right, so the first thing, the first thing we want to do is we're going to go ahead and, and make this post here. 
About six ways a local land surveyor can help with commercial real estate during COVID-19 travel bans. And uh, so I'm going to just go ahead and copy the text content here. And then you can see they, they have a, we have an image attached. So let's start with the text content. And I'm going to come back in the buffer. And so this is going to go out on our Facebook page. We're just going to post this in here. Make sure that we don't have any typos. It just doesn't like those words. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to grab the image, which I didn't download yet. So let's go ahead and download that from Trello. Which I got to remember how to do. Can I do it like this? Yeah, so open a new tab, save image as. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and add our image. Okay, now this is our call to action here. Uh, so we're trying to we're trying to point people to an article on our website. So we want to make sure and add that link. Okay, which should have been in the post there. I don't think it was. That wasn't in the post, so we should have the link here in the post, and we don't. So let's go ahead and get that link. Okay, guys, so I've got that link copied now from our website. So we'll go back to Buffer. We'll drop that in, and then we're just going to say schedule post. We're actually going to copy all this. Okay, so now that's in the hopper for tomorrow. Okay, so we want to go ahead and fill up our afternoon slot, which we've got in here. So this is the post we won't, we're not afraid of zoning. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and copy this. And we're going to pull it over to Facebook, or pull it over to Buffer, sorry. Okay, and then we need to add our image. So let's come over and grab our image that we've got. Oh, I don't have the image here, but I know where I, I, know where I stuck it. All right, guys, so I found that image. Let's go ahead and add that. And we want to make sure we include a call to action here, which we did not. So we're going to say, contact us. To get your rezoning report. And then we're going to go ahead and link to our website. So we're just going to link to our contact page for this one. Okay, then we're going to say schedule post. Okay, so now we've got two posts going out for tomorrow. Um, this is for uh, Redefine Horizons Facebook page. And so actually I realized this is Monday. So these are all off a day. <laughs> so let's fix that on our calendar. Okay, so we've scheduled these two posts on the Facebook page. Now what we want to do, we want to make sure we get those on our other channels. So we're just going to click down here. Uh, Twitter's, Twitter's a little tougher because you, your posts have to be short. So you really need to be able to link to a specific resource on Twitter. Okay, so let's just look at these two. We can link to an article here. We really don't have this on our website as standalone content yet. So uh, we don't have anything to link to, but we can certainly link to this article. So let's go ahead and go back. So in this case for Twitter, we're only going to have one thing for tomorrow. Okay, and so we got to customize this content a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this. Okay, so I'm going to say learn six ways local answer error can help, blah, 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 blah. And then we're going to drop in the link to that article. Okay, and it's automatically going to find the image for us, which is cool. 
we're going to say schedule post. Okay, so we might only have one thing going out on Twitter tomorrow, or I need to make sure that this post about zoning uh, gets on our website, which it should be on there anyway, so we'll probably do that. All right, so hang tight. We got one more channel to go. I know I'm at 10 minutes. I like to try and keep these videos to 10 minutes. So, Okay, then the last channel we have is this is my LinkedIn page. We have a, a company LinkedIn page too. So uh, we're going to come in. Once you've got, got one of them up, it's pretty easy to just come in here and you can edit and copy these. So I'm going to come down and make sure this goes out on my LinkedIn tomorrow. Okay, what this is telling me is this post is too long for LinkedIn, uh, which is a bummer. So uh, we're going to have to we're going to have to trim this a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say here is one specific way a good land surveyor can help. Okay, then I'm going to delete these, and I'm going to say to learn more to learn about five more ways. And we can uh, visit this article, which is obviously too long. Okay, so we gotta trim this a little bit more. Okay, so that's good. We're gonna go ahead and schedule that. Okay, and then we want to get our afternoon post on. So again, I'm going to come in and try and copy that. This one I think should fit without too much trouble. Oh, almost. So get that to fit. And then we're going to replace this with an image. So we're going to grab our not afraid of zoning image. Oh, I'm still a little long. Oh, let's see. Okay, so we'll schedule that. All right, so just to review, what we've got now is for tomorrow, Tuesday, we've got two posts on our Redefined Horizons Facebook page. We've got one tweet going out on our Twitter page, and we've got two po two posts going out on our on my LinkedIn page. Okay, and then we'll add the afternoon tweet once we get the article about zoning posted to our website. Okay, so then what I do is I just if any of this is appropriate to our, our uh, learning channels, I do those posts separately generally. Okay, so in this case, in this case, most of this is marketing content. Uh, it's not really made for other surveyors, uh, the, the content, these two pieces of content. So I don't have to worry about, I don't have to worry about our Facebook, uh, link, uh, Facebook learning page, but I am going to go ahead and put this on our company LinkedIn page. So I'm going to go to LinkedIn. And I'll search for my company. And then we're just going to go ahead and manually schedule these posts right now. So again, what we can come back in here to buffer. I remember where I put buffer. Here it is. And I generally, since we already trimmed our content to fit on LinkedIn, we want to, we're just going to steal from this LinkedIn spot. All right, let's see. So we're going to paste this in. We're, we want it to go out to anybody. 
Okay, I obviously have a little bit of formatting to do here. So we're going to break this up. Okay. Then we're going to post this link in again. So we're just trying to get people to click on this link. All right, and it says it's still a little long. All right, so we got that to fit. We'll go ahead and post. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and uh, put in our afternoon post for tomorrow. So we're going to go back to buffer. And we'll copy this out. just going to break up this add a little white space here so this is easier to read okay and it looks like it fits which is good news okay we want to add our we're going to close this and add our photo All right, and I would manually post that to our Facebook learning page if it was also uh, if it was learning content uh, for surveyors, but it's not. It's it's marketing related, so uh, we only have to manually post it here. So just to kind of review, we moved our content over to our calendar. These have posted, which is good. Okay, so then we can fill the queue for Wednesday and Thursday. We're going to have some more content to add for Friday, and we principally do that using this tool here in Buffer. All right, guys, I know that video was long, but hopefully it gives you an idea how you can schedule your social media content using Trello and Buffer.